Okay, so the question is, fastest way to grow an Instagram account and increase reach, paid and organic strategies. Uh, yes, you know, my, my favorite way, um, you know, uh, shortest time to grow is by using IG ads, um, especially if you can use, use it through, you know, learn how to do it through FB ads manager. Uh, it gives you the, the, the most options and you can grow in a, in a more strategic way. So that's like, if I were only to give one answer, that would be my answer. That if I were to only ask someone to do one thing, that's the one thing is to learn how to do Instagram ads through Facebook ads manager with, um, with a thoughtfulness to separating out what you advertise to um, warm audience versus cool audience. Okay, warm audience is basically your website visit. Okay, I'll just do this one. Okay, warm audience includes your website visitors. You can even make an advertisement to specific people who visit specific pages on your website is, is you can go as detailed as you want, which is amazing. Um, people who have engaged with your IG account in the past 365 days or uh, more, more advanced is to separate out a 90 day audience as warm and 91 to 365 day audience, sorry, a audience as lukewarm. So I, I, I actually do that. Anyway, it doesn't matter. Um, now I'm gonna actually say, sorry, I'm gonna say 60 day and 60, this is actually what I do these days. And then, so you have your website visitors, people have engaged, and then you have your, uh, your email list uploaded to FB Ads Manager. If you didn't use FB Ads Manager, you couldn't upload your email list to your, to your Instagram ads as, a, as an audience. Um, and then also your, if you have a Facebook biz page, um, you can also target those engagers in IG ads as well. So the nice thing about a warm audience is that um, basically, Okay, let me start cool audience. Cool audience is anyone who isn't in the above warm audiences, okay? Um, and is most like your warm audience in values and purchasing behavior, okay? So um, this is the power of FB ads managers lookalike audience, okay? Uh, which is created from the seed source seed slash source of your warm audience so literally you could create use facebook's amazing and scary <laughs> knowledge of everybody in the world uh all the detailed data points to say hey facebook uh i'm gonna upload to you um or i'm gonna i'm gonna i'm gonna create a, a an audience of people who have visited my sales page these are the people who have visited my sales page can you please give me a million of all the people in your database, give me a million of the people who are most like the people who have visited my sales page, the kinds of posts they like, the kinds of topics they like, the kinds of topics they engage with, the kinds of purchasing behaviors they have through Facebook platform, the kinds of events they go to. You know all that stuff, the, the age, the demographics, the kinds of friends they have, you know, <laughs> what they do in their bathroom, because you know everything, right? Uh, give me the audience most like that. And the lookalike audience is what you can create through. So it's amazing. So you kind of start there with a cool audience and then you can narrow it down to say, well, I just want to reach people who are in this age range in these countries or in this major metropolitan area. So this is why the shortest time to growing an IG ad account is through ads. Sorry, uh, IG account is through ads. Now, besides ads, let's say, uh, you know, I don't want to pay, you know, Facebook or Instagram. I don't, I just want to do organically without ads. Okay. Organic fast growth is the following now okay be careful about using popular hashtags because the first thing people are going to say oh george easy hashtag love <laughs> hashtag happy hashtag you know boss babe <laughs> whatever whatever the popular hashtags are be careful about using these because you end up with a large and irrelevant warm audience because now they've engaged with your posts and your ad cost will go up dramatically so why do i say ad cost because at some point 
if you really want to be, okay, either that, and that's bad because of two reasons. Either your ad cost will go up dramatically or your algorithm will be messed up. They won't care about your offers, only your babe picks and inspirational quotes. You see what I mean? Like you're, you're gonna build, you're gonna build this audience of people who like, they really like it when you look sexy. They really like it when you have inspirational quotes. But when you start selling your service or product, they're like, who is this? I, I don't see. It's totally not the right audience. So I, that's why I'm like, okay, if you're going to use hashtags, if you'll use hashtags, think of it. Think of each hashtag as a community of people. You know, you kind of have to look at the hashtag and go, hmm, look at these six, the last six to nine to 12 posts on the hashtag, do I like these people? Do I want to be seen by these people? Uh, are these my potential referral sources or potential clients? And, um, and is, uh, is, you know, if that's the case, you know, uh, uh, I, used to, you know I, I don't use hashtags anymore, but I'd say anywhere between 50K, uh, you know, 10K, 10K to, um, uh, I'm gonna say 100K followers. Is might be might be a sweet spot, but again, you know, uh, you can break break the rules if you find a really ideal ideal hashtag. Okay, um, okay, so maybe hashtags, but I would say the fastest organic growth is to do IG live collabs with um, other IG influencers. Fastest way. Um, oh. The other thing is uh, to promote your IG page everywhere, you know, email newsletter, um, all other social media, right? But really, this is this is this is the fastest way. So, um, Viana, let me know if you have any questions about that or if that helps. Okay, cool. Um, by the way, I don't have email newsletter. Any okay, not yet. Or That's fine. That's fine. So, so it, you know, because I'm quite new, so it's quite yeah. overwhelming to start yeah. all these things. Yeah. Like, do you mm -hmm. do you have any resources or course that teach like if someone's starting from zero, like what is the order and, and how do I, yeah. you know, create all of these things? Yeah, from starting from scratch, right? Um, okay. The like order. right now, all I have is an Instagram account. I don't even have a. Um, like a Facebook business page, like I, I, it's it's creative. It's got you know nothing in. Yeah. You know. This is my one course. Like uh, if if people if if someone said George, I only want to ever buy one thing from you and nothing else. Say that's great. Get this one, my business planning class, because this basically gives you know relatively you know this is my entire strategy in three sessions. Um, yeah, it's relatively inexpensive. It's one of my most inexpensive courses. It's not that much. It's, I think it's, it's under $100 US, but it, in, it includes all of my um, strategies. It includes templates for planning. It includes kind of a step-by-step -step plan in a general sense. For those people who want to dive into ads, I have a whole course on Facebook, Instagram ads. But yeah, this is, this is, this is my, my simple answer, <laughs> the recommended strategy. Okay, cool. All right. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Thank you.